Good afternoon, YouTube. These are the uh, Arboretum Trail Loop. This is one of their mountain biking trails they have, which either both mountain bikers and hikers can uh, both use it. They generally ask you to 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 not ride to not ride them during periods of mud because obviously that can really tear the trails up. We're near the Wingo Picnic area right here so here's a map of the uh not sure how well you guys could see it but a map of the mountain biking trails I'm pretty sure I've probably went through some of them myself on the on the way over here and probably just didn't realize it you know but here's the hiking trails right over in this area they have a good trail system here uh you could ride your mountain bike here which is of course nice and uh and in general i could see some some tire prints some tire prints which is a good thing in footprints so the trails are in good shape to ride so if you're able to ride get out here and ride because the ground is good and frozen right now so trails won't get rooted up or you know chopped all to pieces you know I think while some of us do like to hike in the mud and I do too but you got to realize too that that also damages the trails and and when there is extremely muddy conditions find alternate trails in a park that drive faster because I see the point they're trying to do because they don't want to continue to destroy trails and create more work for the volunteers and the park system this is a nice wide track here for the mountain bike users I, I don't think I've been on these particular trails I'm pretty sure some of the trails I was on earlier were probably for the uh, mountain bike rescue access See, it kind of points you to power line right here skills park back that way or at least I think that's what it is but anyway I'm gonna keep on trucking here so I guess this is the Arboretum loop one of the trails here
I think I've seen a couple bikes, but I haven't seen anybody out riding with them on the trails yet, but the ground is very good and firmed up with the uh, cold weather to bring your bike out here or bring yourself out here and hike. You know, don't matter where you hike at, find somewhere that you love to hike at. Doesn't have to be the most challenging trail. It doesn't have to be the longest hike. Just find somewhere, even if you can only get a mile or two in, 30 to 45 minutes hiking is better than nothing. Get out here. Good thing I got all day at least <laughs> to be in here for most of the day. Follow this trail till wherever it leads. Wherever the yellow brick road leads. Great thing is, you know, hikers and bikers both share the trail when it's in there. <coughs> it's in very good shape. I just know I'm on the trails. I don't know this trail the first time I think I've been on this. But it really doesn't matter to me.
Looks like some more pine trees over there. A few of them at least. Oh, I see a trail signage down here, so we'll see what we got. power line trail right there oh. that's it for this one